What's cracking YouTube? My name's Brody and welcome to another Pokemon trading card game opening. And today we are back with the Dust Mane Necrozma Ultra Prism Elite Trainer Box. So if you guys missed out on my opening of the Dawn Wings Necrozma version of this Elite Trainer Box, be sure to go check that one out. I'll leave a link up in the iCard in the top right hand corner of the screen. And uh, yeah, there's not really too much else to say. It's a pretty old Elite Trainer Box now. I guess it's slowly starting to get a bit older. The last one that we opened showed a lot of potential to have a lot of crazy good pulls and that's what we need from this set we need some good stuff today so fingers crossed we can get that so if you guys are keen for today's opening be sure to drop a like down below subscribe if you're new and click that bell next to the subscribe button to be notified whenever i upload but with that said let's just crack the seal on this elite trainer box and then we'll go through all of the bits and pieces for those guys who have never seen one of these before uh like myself this is the first one that i'm opening on the channel of this variant of the box and uh, yeah, just take a look at everything. And then from there, we'll crack into the packs and just kind of go from there. So this is the back of the box uh, for those guys who would like to pause and have a read of that one. But uh, I'm not going to go through all that. But you guys can see right there everything that comes inside of this box today. And uh, yeah, so that's that. Inside of this, you've got a cool little like poster of sorts that you can... Um display if you if you would like to if that's your your thing you got like a collection going of those it's definitely like check out that box that looks so cool this is the player's guide so it gives you a rough idea of like how to play the game and stuff like that and what bits and pieces of this set can be used for just like that and um kind of goes through prism cards there and then you have the checklist so this you can use as a, as a checklist there there's two boxes the black ones for your normal set the red ones for your reverse hollow so you can tick them off in there which is pretty cool a little feature that a lot of people don't know and they also have a version of that on the pokemon website as well uh, a checklist that you can use but at the back here this is what we're mainly looking looking for here from this set here you've got uh, a couple of the cards there you've got the leaf yawn and pheromos full art there and then you've got the, the massive page here of Ultra Rares as well. One of the main ones on this page being the Cynthia there and the Lily at this current moment in time are the two of the most playable ones on that page. And then on this page over here, I believe the Vulcan is not too bad. Not too bad at all. And then on the very last page, you have the very heavily sought after gold cards there. You got the Lunala and the Solgaleo. And the uh, I got the Escape Board just recently on the channel too, which is pretty pretty sick. It's an awesome looking card. But definitely let me know, let me know your favorite card from this set in the comment section below. They're all displayed there. Let me know your favorite in the comment section below. But we'll throw that off to the side there. And then let's get into the, the contents of the box itself. So there's some packaging. We've got the top of the box there, the little side inserts. We have the sleeves there, awesome looking sleeves, definitely amazing sleeves. Not worth like the price that you pay for the box, but still some pretty cool looking sleeves at the end of the day. We have, what's that, five packs there. And then we have another three. So that is our eight boost packs that you get inside of these Elite Trainer Boxes. So we'll throw them just kind of out of the way for now. You have your deck dividers, awesome looking, uh, awesome looking these ones look really cool to be honest i love the black the black and the gold it looks so cool so cool then we've got our package sleeves this time sometimes they come in a band sometimes they come packed like this i prefer them uh sealed like that so they're always in minty fresh condition i'm gonna redeem this one on tcgo myself sorry about that guys always have to keep uh, i gotta get those limited edition sleeves on tcgo while i can and there we go there is the dice the dice the they're so cool. I love these dice as well. They come like with the uh, little set logo on the side there. Pretty cool. And that's the whole contents of the box there. So we're going to throw everything back in there. You got your poison and burn and the GX marker there. And yeah, that's everything. So not bad. Not bad at all. We'll throw the uh, th throw the lid back on here. Whoops. Forgot the sleeves. Forgot the sleeves. Go in there. And let's get into these packs and hope for the finest. Like I said, the last one that we opened had had really high um, high pull rates. I'll put it that way. Had really high pull rates. So I'm hoping that this one can do the same for me today. So let's get into this first pack and hope for the finest. When we get a green code, it's not always a bad thing. It's definitely not always a bad thing. Because there is pr there are prisms in this set. And I believe one of the ones that we want is a ditto prism. So here we go, guys. We have a Lickitung, Weasel, Eevee, Salandit, Turtwig, a Metal Energy, Yane Mega, Luka, Electric Memory, Cosmoam Reverse Holo, so no break in this pack, unfortunately, and a Salazzle Regular Rare. Alrighty, onto this Giratina pack art up next. I love the pack arts in this set. Actually, a lot of these Sun and Moon ones that they've done recently have had really, um, really awesome looking uh, just box art and pack arts in general. So I'm really, really quite satisfied with these uh, 
recent Sun and Moon series sets. Definitely a lot more interesting than the Sun and Moon base. Which Sun and Moon base did have five different pack arts, which was the first time I believe they've ever had five different pack arts. But um, yeah, fun facts. We have a Rotom Reverse Holo this time with a Fan Rotom Regular Rare. 70 HP there with the ability Rotom Motor and Spinning Fans. It's interesting that we went from the uh, the regular Rotom there to the fan, the fan version. Alrighty, let's just throw that carrot off to the side. And here we go. So this box isn't showing anywhere near as much promise as the last one so far, but we still have another five packs to crack into after this one. So we're um we've still got plenty of chances here to spice things up a little bit. So we get a scum tank, a pal pad. Turtwig Reverse Holo with that cool looking cartoony art there and just a Drapion regular rare. Alrighty, on to the uh, Dustman Necrozma pack art. Next, just about called it Solgaleo. Just about called it Solgaleo. <laughs> Jeez. Jeez, we're going back to back to back to back <laughs> back with these green codes right now. Once again, isn't a bad thing if we can, as long as we can get that Prism pull. So we have a Cosmog, Turtwig, Electabuzz, Cherubi, Glamyow. A Fairy Energy, Pokemon Fan Club, Primplup, Looker's Whistle, or Looker Whistle. We have a Fire Memory, Reverse Holo, and just an Alolan Exeggutor. So yeah, hopefully, hopefully we've cleared out the duds now, and then we have just straight power for these last four here. That would be amazing. That would be amazing. Generally, like eight packs, you're probably only expecting two of these, two of these white codes three out the eight if you get three then you've done well in my opinion if i was if i were to talk like ratios but let's see let's see what our first one has our first hit of the box here we have a shinx carnivine murkrow magnemite snova lightning energy a missing clover floatzel brugly a shaman reverse holo rare and we have a chrysalia holo rare interesting not a bad way to start here. 120 HP with Luna Payback and Psychic. There we go. Not a bad way to kick things off. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. There's some more, some more in this side, inside of this box. Alrighty, four and two here. Let's see what we can do. <clears throat> so we have a Riolu, Diglett, Primplop, Salandit, Pissimian. A Fairy Energy, Unidentified Fossil, Monferno, Autopad, a Hippopotas, Reverse Holo Common, and just a Wash Rotom Regular Rare. So there's two, two variants of the Rotom there. Down to our final two booster packs here, guys. Hopefully, hopefully we can get that above average box with two, two white code balls here. Damn it. Damn it, this pack's plain hard to get. There we go. Jeez, this is not looking too good today, guys. But once again, if we can get that ditto, uh, ditto prism, it's not, not a bad thing. Not a bad thing at all. So we have a Roselia, Gibble, Electabuzz, Chimchar, Pachirisu, a Lightning Energy once again, Shieldon, Gumshoes, Cherum, Prugly Reverse Hollow, unfortunately, no prism and just a Roserade, a regular rare. So we're going for a kind of standard box if we do manage to pull something here, guys. So wish me wish me luck, guys. Here we go, we have a Giratina pack art here to finish things off. Let's see if I can avoid spoilers. Avoid spoilers. This could be, this could be bad or this could be good, okay? Final pack. We have a Carnivine, Glamyow, Drifloon, Sandshrew, Hippopotas, a unlisted leaf energy there. We got a Turtonator, a bit of a mind blank, a low punny, Honchcrow, Cherubi Reverse Holo, so no prism in this pack. And we have to finish things off today. No, a Toxic Croak. Regular rare. It's done it to me, guys. It has done it to me. I can't believe my luck. My luck is so bad. I've, I've spoken about it on the channel as of late. Ever since I've kind of come back to uploading recently, my luck has been terrible. But we walk away from a quite an expensive elite trainer box with a hollow Cresselia. That's all I have to say. That is all I have to say. Nothing. 
nothing. But of course, we walk away with all the goodies that come inside the box, which I can't even get out for you guys right now. It literally just doesn't even want to move. But that's okay, guys. That's okay. You, you, can, you win some, you lose some. But unfortunately, today, I definitely lost big time. But uh, if you guys would like to see a better a better Elite Trainer Box opening, definitely go check out the uh, the Dawn Wings one that I opened on the channel just recently. Or definitely go check out my opening of every Elite Trainer Box from the XY series. And the pla oh, black and white slash XY series. It's like everyone up to date when I uploaded the video. Anyway, anyways, guys, if you guys did enjoy today's opening, regardless of the trash pulls that we got today, be sure to drop a like down below. Subscribe if you're new. Click that bell next to the subscribe button to be notified whenever I upload and check out my social media. Links are in the video description. But with that said, I'm going to get up out of here. Thanks for watching today's opening and I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one. Peace.